Hello everyone, I am Shweta Jay from Commerce Department, Gopal Swami PU College, Mysore. Welcome back to Business Studies class. In last class, we have discussed about money market and its instruments. In today's session, we are going to discuss about capital market and the differences between capital market and money market and the components of capital market. Now, let's get started. As you all know, money market is a market which provides short-term funds to the business organization. Whereas, capital market is a market for long-term funds which satisfies the long-term capital requirement of the business concern. So, capital market refers to the institution and mechanism whereby medium and long-term funds are pooled and made available to individuals, government and business concern. These funds are utilized in making investment in the fixed assets. Fixed assets mele investment maad beko, atwa one plant and machinery na purchase maad beko anta hai ladre, uh, crores together agate, lakhs together investment agate, like a 50 lakh investment maad beko agate. So, a 50 lakh na na willi raise maad bodo, capital market ali raise maad bodo. The instrument which are used in the capital markets are shares, debenture, bonds, etc. whose maturity period ranging between 1 to 25 years or more. The main function of the capital market is to encourage people to invest their small savings into most productive use, which leads to growth and development of the economy. So now let's know the differences between the capital market and money market. The first point here, participants. As you all know, the participants in the capital market are banks, financial institution, individual investors, industrial sectors, government, etc. Whereas, in the money market, the participants are Reserve Bank of India, financial institutions, individual investors, etc. The main instruments which are traded in the capital markets are shares, debenture, bonds and other securities, etc. Whereas in the money market, the instruments are traded like treasury bills, certificate of deposits, call money, commercial bill, so on. The next, investment outlay. The main function of the capital market is to encourage people to invest their small savings into most productive use. In the capital market, the shares, debentures which are available at low price, the people with the small savings can invest in the capital market. But it is not possible in the case of money market because the value of the instruments is comparatively very high than capital market. Capital market ali sigu vantaha instrument in a shares agir bodu, debentures agir bodu, per value bandu 5 rupees, 10 rupees anta erate. But money market ali available iru anta instruments like a treasury bills agir bodu, certificate of deposit agir bodu and the commercial bill agir bodu. The value of all these instruments is quite expensive. The next one is duration. As you all know, the capital market deals with the instrument whose maturity period is more than one year. But in the money market, the maturity period of instrument is less than one year. Capital market ali available iro instrument to maturity period more than one year irate. But money market ali maturity period bandu less than one year irate. And the next one is liquidity. So capital market provides an opportunity to the investors that they can uh, convert their shares or investment into cash at any time. Yavak bekadra auru cash agi convert markulta hogbodu. Sometimes it is very difficult to the investor to find buyer in the capital market. So, kelvo me ena agate capital market ali shares anna easy agi sale maada dikke agodila. But in the money market, there is a specific mechanism that is DFHI. That is nothing but Discount Finance House of India. And this uh, particular institution provides an opportunity to the investors of the money market that they can convert their investment into cash at any time. With the help of this particular institution, the investors of money market can convert their investment into cash at any time. But it is not possible in the case of the capital market. So that is the differences between capital market and the money market. 
The next one is safety. Compared to money market, capital market instruments are riskier both in terms of return and the repayment of principal amount. Risk jasti irate, mosa madu anta chances jasti irate. Illi capital market ali. But money market ali ariti agodila. Yakanta heladre, the participants in the money markets are Reserve Bank of India and large and credit worthy companies. They have the ability to repay the principal amount to their investors. The next one is expected return in capital market investors can get a high return than in the money market money market ginda hechagi return anna naavu capital market alli expect maartta hogbodu because the only reason is the duration of the instruments is more than 1 year so these are all the differences between the capital market and money market so now this capital market has two components the first one is primary market and the second one is secondary market. So now let's know the meaning of primary market. Primary market is also known as new issue market. Why it is called as new issue market? Because in this market securities are sold for the first time by the new companies. For example, if you start a company in a start market, Generally, the basic requirement of any kind of business is finance. So, the owner of the business can raise its required finance through issue of shares, debentures or any other securities in the specific market called primary market. Namge beka giro finance na rise maadu dikke, naven maadu tivi, shares na issue maadu tivi, one particular market ali, a market na naven hel tivi, primary market tanta hel tivi. The essential function of the primary market is capital formation. Yeena do capital formation anta hel adre. It means, it facilitates transfer of surplus funds from savers to an entrepreneur for setting up new projects, diversification or expansion of the business etc. So here in the primary market, company can directly raise its required finance from the investors or from the public through issue of shares and debentures. Direct again now investors anna atwa public anna approach maadi namge beka giro capital anna rise maadta hook tv. Aon the market anna hain hel tv, primary market anna hel tv. Who are the investors in the primary market? The investors in the primary market are banks, financial institutions, mutual funds, insurance companies, individual investors, etc. Now let's know the meaning of secondary market. The secondary market is the market for sale and purchase of previously issued or second hand securities. So this is the primary market. The primary market is the company that start with fresh shares and issue. So, that is primary market and the TV. Secondary market and the TV. Once the securities are allotted to the investor by the uh, issuing a company in the primary market, thereafter they can be traded in the secondary market only. In secondary market, securities are not directly issued by the company to the investors. For example, one company start by one 10 crore capital avashikati irate so ee 10 crores ali 5 crores matra capital ide innu 5 crores illa so aga avaru en maartare so remaining 5 crores anna avaru shares athwa debentures anna issue maadi tagolta hogtare elli issue maadbeko primary market ali issue maartare here the company just issue their shares or sell their shares at first time in primary market so here with the help of the primary market a new company can raise its required finance through issue of shares or debentures to the general public so illi issue maadiro shares anna public ku purchase maadidare again public adana sale maadbeku anta heladre adana elli sale maadabodu that is only in secondary market here the securities are sold by existing investors to the other investors 
ಯಾರೋ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಮಾಡಿರ್ತಾರೆ ಈಗ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ಸಡನ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಬೇಕಾಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಈಗೇನ್ ಅದನ್ನ ಅವರು ಪ್ರೈಮರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಸೇಲ್ ಮಾಡೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಆಗೋದಿಲ್ಲ ಸೊ ಅವ್ರು ಈಗೇನ್ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಆ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಸೆಕೆಂಡರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಸೇಲ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಸೊ ಯಾರಿಗೆ ಅದನ್ನ ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಇರುತ್ತೋ ಆಗ ಅವರು ಸೆಕೆಂಡರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಅದನ್ನ ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಹೋಗ್ಬಹುದು ಸೊ ಹಿಯರ್ ವಿತ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಇನ್ವೆಸ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಮೀಟ್ ಈಚ್ ಅದರ್ ಸೊ ಬೈ ದಿಸ್ secondary market provides liquidity and marketability to the securities and this uh, secondary market consists of recognized stock exchanges operating under rules laws and regulations duly approved by the government so this market is also known as stock market or stock exchanges ಪ್ರೈಮರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ನ್ಯೂ ಕಂಪನಿ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಇಶ್ಯೂ ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ಇಶ್ಯೂ ಮಾಡಿರೋದನ್ನ ತಗೊಂಡು ನಿಮ್ಗೆ ಯಾವಾಗ ಬೇಕಾದ್ರೂ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಆಗಿ ಕನ್ವರ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಬಹುದು ಅದು ಎಲ್ಲಿ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಾದ್ರೆ ಸೆಕೆಂಡರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಮಾತ್ರ ಕನ್ವರ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳೋದಕ್ಕೆ ಸಾಧ್ಯ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಪ್ರೈಮರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡರಿ ಮಾರ್ಕೆಟ್ ನಾವು ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ನೋ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದ ವೇ ಹೌ ದ ಕಂಪನಿ ಇಶ್ಯೂ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿಬೆಂಚರ್ಸ್ at first time in primary market here flotation explains you about the way how the company issue its shares to the public the first one is offer through prospectors before going to rise required capital in primary market through shares and debentures etc first of all before going to rise required capital company need to issue prospectus to inform and attract general public in prospectus a company need to provide detailed information about the purpose for which funds are being raised past financial performances of the company background and future prospectus of the company a prospectus makes a direct appeal to raise capital through an advertisement in newspaper and magazine the information in the prospectus helps the investors to know about the risk and earning potential of the company and accordingly they decide whether to invest or not in the company company shares ಅನ್ನ ಇಶ್ಯೂ ಮಾಡೋದಕ್ಕೂ ಮುಂಚೆ ಪ್ರಾಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಇಶ್ಯೂ ಮಾಡಬೇಕಾಗತ್ತೆ ಏನದು ಪ್ರಾಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟಸ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರೆ ಪ್ರಾಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಅ ಇನ್ವಿಟೇಷನ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇನ್ವೈಟ್ಸ್ ದ ಪಬ್ಲಿಕ್ ಟು ಸಬ್ಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಕಂಪನಿ ನಮ್ಮ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ನೀವು ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ಒಂದು ಇನ್ವಿಟೇಷನ್ ಅನ್ನ ಕೊಡ್ತೀವಿ ಸೊ ಅದನ್ನ ನಾವೇನ್ ಹೇಳ್ತೀವಿ ಪ್ರಾಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟಸ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತೀವಿ ಅಂಡ್ ದ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಫರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಸೇಲ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಮೆಥಡ್ ಸೆಕ್ಯೂರಿಟೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇಶ್ಯೂಡ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಟು ದಿ ಪಬ್ಲಿಕ್ ಬಟ್ ಆರ್ ಆಫರ್ಡ್ for sale through intermediaries like brokers under this method company is saved from the formalities and complexities of issuing securities directly to the public public ge now direct agi issue madidre one these two formalities anna follow madbekagittu expenses jaasti aagta itto instead of issuing securities directly to the public first company issue its shares to the intermediaries intermediaries like brokers first to brokers ke issue maartare and brokers en maartare a securities anna company inda purchase maadi adhe securities anna public ge sale maartta hogtare so this is nothing but offer for sale and the next one is private placement under this method company allot its securities or issue its securities to the selected individuals or institutions so company ili en madute securities anna selected in investors ge matra issue maartta hogtare selected institutions ge matra issue maartta hogtare this private placement method is a cost saving method as company is saved from the expenses of brokerage charges a commission listing of company's name in the stock exchange so here most of the small and new companies prefer private placement because as they cannot afford to rise from the public issue public direct agi new public age issue maadbeku securities anna anta heladre first nimma securities stock exchange alli list out agirbeku brokers anna appoint maadbeku commission provide maadbekagutte so here in order to avoid those expenses company issue its securities to their selected institutions or selected investors the next is right issue so under this method a company given a privilege or preferences to their 
existing shareholders or current shareholders to purchase their new shares of the company. So, if you new shares and issue, you can get new shares and already you can get shareholders preferences and you can get purchase. So, you can get healthy, right issue and healthy. And the next one is EIPOS. Here, a company issue its securities to the general public through online system of stock exchange. So, for this, first of all, company need to appoint broker for the purpose of accepting application and placing orders with the company. So, all online alle na wo in mad bodo share sanna issue mad tar hai. A share sanna na wo purchase mad ta hog bodo. So, adhuna na vein health bhi electronic initial public offers santa health. So, these are all the method of flotation in primary market. Now, let's know the differences between primary market and secondary market. Here in primary market, it deals with the securities which is issued at first time. Whereas in secondary market, it deals with the second and securities which is already issued in the primary market. Primary market ali issue maadhi ro securities anna purchase maadhi ro sale maadhi ro yelli agathe anta hella the secondary market ali agathe. The second differences is, so here uh, securities are sold by the companies to the general public. So here issuing company directly issue its securities to the public. Whereas in the secondary market, the ownership of the security exchange between the investors. And the third difference is here the primary market facilitates transfer of surplus funds from savers to an entrepreneur for establishing company. Company and establish maadu dikke enu uh, now easy agi fund and rise maad bodu through issue of shares directly to the public. Public ke direct ag issue maadi now or in the capital and rise maad bodu. Adi illi agathe primary market ali agathe. But in a secondary market it is not possible because secondary market indirectly promotes the capital formation. The next one is in primary market, only buying of securities are takes place. But in the secondary market, both buying and selling of securities are takes place. And the last differences between primary market and secondary market is, uh, the price of the securities is determined by the management of the company. When securities are price in a decide maadhtare, primary market ali anta heladhe, the company decide maadhtare, because the company issue its shares at first time in the primary market. Primary market ali First time, our issue Martha Rodrinda, a shares price and a determine Mado Diaru and the company decide Madate. Whereas in the secondary market, the price of the securities are determined by the demand and supply for the securities. So, these are all the differences between primary market and secondary market. I hope you have understood today's topic that is capital market and the differences between capital market and money market and primary market and the method of flotation is very important concept because it is asked for four mark question in your examination and differences between the primary market and secondary market. Thank you.